What is up? How's it going, everybody? So I was in my local Walmart the other day, and I was looking for Ned Riggs. You guys know how much I love throwing Ned Riggs. And I came across these Ned Rig Rage Bugs. These are in like a green pumpkin, peanut butter looking color crawdad. You can see here, they are a Rage Ned Bug, Banana Crawl, or Bama Crawl, sorry. I'm excited to try these things. They haven't been opened yet, and if you know anything about Strike King, they put a scent on them. So I like to keep these things sealed up until I'm ready to start throwing them. I picked up a few different packs of these, and I'm hoping they do pretty good. I have caught some smallies on the green pumpkin, and so I'm hoping these do just as good in the creeks and the rivers for some smallies and some largies. But they should be fun to throw. They come with a... They're two and a half inches. They do come with some Ned Rig hooks in there already. And just overall a great bait. If you're looking for just a cheap bait just to try and you haven't caught a fish in a while and you just want to go catch some fish, I highly, highly, highly recommend throwing on a Ned Rig. These Rage Bugs work great in the creeks and the rivers. And if you're at a lake that has crawdads in it or crayfish, whatever you call them, these things will do pretty good. Or mud bugs, whatever you call them. These will do pretty good because the bass are going to be accustomed to eating them. Now you can't really throw crawdad, mud bug, crayfish lures in an area that doesn't have crayfish. Because the bass aren't going to know what that is. They're just going to think it's a stick or whatever. But you throw them in an area that has some craw, some crayfish, mud bug, or crawdads in them. These things will do phenomenal. But until next time, guys and gals, don't forget to like, comment, smash that doobly doo. Take the next generation fishing. Pass on the love of the sport. And until next time, I'll see you guys out on the water. Thanks for watching.